your first giving of your wisdom and experience, was it actually with a book or was it actually with a seminar or training? Um, it was actually with a, um, I started off um, in, a, in another community. So I started speaking and then as I gathered more information, it then started with, I'm um, just trying to think back, it started back with speaking then I, and then when I designed my core, when I wrote the Live Love uh, by Design book earlier this year, that just brought everything I'd learned over the past five years into one sort of area. And as soon as I wrote the book, I created my online course. I created everything. It all just flowed. And it really was just the compilation of everything that I had learned. And I just loved it. And, and even at the end of the book, um, I even have... Dan listed as my co-author because I know he brings it all together for me. He yeah. helps me to see um, what I probably, he helps me to see from a different awareness and a different perspective on everything. And I'm, I very rarely get angry now, which is what I love. And I allow people to be who they are. I may suggest things that they can look at, but I don't try and change anyone. I don't put my beliefs onto anyone. I just allow, which is a beautiful way to be. And it's a beautiful way for everyone in our world to be, to go, do you know what? I don't understand what you're about, but I'm allowing you to be that way. Like, I don't need to change you, if that means. Because I don't want to make it say, well, I'm superior to them. I'm not. I just don't understand but it's okay i don't have to spend the next hour trying to convince you this is the way because it doesn't work and it's so much easier on my body if i don't do that 